Hey, good afternoon. My name is Ashley and I work with Downtown Marketing and I was doing some research in the area of local HVAC companies and I came across your website and I wanted to reach out because I wanted to quickly show you how you can easily beat out your competition online with just a couple of tips. And I want to show you what's working well for your competitors and how you can do the same and even more than that. And I didn't want to take up too much of your time. But at the end of this, if you wouldn't mind responding to the email with some feedback about the video, just letting me know if it was helpful, that I would definitely appreciate that. Um, but if uh, I hope the information that I give you can help increase your business online. And if not, it's no harm, no foul. Don't, no worries. Um, so the first thing I wanted to kind of go over was the content more especially the home page, the first page. Typically we want to see about 1,500 to 2,000 words just depending on the competition and the number of keywords that are needed. And a keyword is anything uh, someone types into Google looking for that particular service or product. Um, and your content can play, you can place keywords throughout the, throughout to tell uh, Google exactly what terms you want your website found for. And so that's really going to help increase if someone's typing in certain keywords that are going to um, trigger popping up your website for them. Um, another thing I wanted to go over was the backlinks. And a backlink is anywhere you find one website linking to another through a hyperlink text. <clears throat> so let's just say that a news, you know, a news station did a story on you guys for something and they posted the story online and then in the story had your link to your website. And then, you know, if somebody reading the story could click on it and it would come to your web page. Uh, that's considered a backlink. And these links act like an endorsement for your website from others which Google uses to build trust in your business by seeing others vouching for you, especially more credible backlinks. Um, and um, it's literally like a popularity contest where the most person who has the most wins. Um, and so that that is, you know, where backlinks come in and help with that. And the one last thing I wanted to go over was citations. And a citation is anywhere your business name, number, and address are shown uh, as it is listed on your Google business profile. And a citation helps you rank in the map pack, where, um, which is extremely important for local businesses since these can generate huge amounts of revenue. And this right here would be considered the map pack. Um, strict, um, strictly speaking, you know, people that are, anyone who is searching for a service and they type in keywords, I typed in heating and cooling cold pepper, uh, you know, and this is what popped up. So, you know, Typically what's going to happen is a customer is going to see, um, is going to see the first three and they're going to go, oh, well, let's click on these and, and check that out first and foremost, because they're probably really good. And so the, the whole goal, you know, with the citations is to get into this map pack up here so that that's what happens. Um, <clears throat> and so, yeah, so basically the citations include directories like Yelp, Angie, Expertise, BBB, Chamber of Commerce, things like that, as well as, you know, social media accounts help. And the idea is that your brand begins to be found by Google all over the internet, and the larger that your online presence is, the more Google trusts you. And once Google sees you more often than the competitors, the more likely it is for to rank your company above theirs. Um, and so I kind of wanted to go through and show you what the back end of your website looked like, um, <clears throat> just pulling up with a program we use. Right now you have about 30 backlinks linking back to your page. Um, you have 18 keywords throughout your entire website, which is bringing about 13 potential customers through your website a month. Okay. I pulled up um, just a compet uh, competitor in the area, Able Heating and Air. Um, they have 5,800 backlinks on their page, uh, coming back to their page, 453 keywords and 567 potential customers coming through their through their site a month. So that's a lot of difference in revenue that you're missing out on um, that you could be, you know, you could be getting doing this. <clears throat> so, and once, but once your content backlinks and citations come through, come together, you're going to start to outgrow the competition, you know, as you see it. And I'm not sure what your margins are, but I imagine that would generate some pretty decent revenue. And also there's usually many more keywords you can use uh, to generate more traffic and more leads. So it, it doesn't have to strictly be just the certain ones, but it could be far beyond. Um, and this is what I do for a living. And I'm creating this video for you to help you start generating these leads online. Um, 
And so just feel free to reach out and, and I can help you with some more information or we can talk about your goals and I can do the research to find out exactly what could be realistic for your business and what it might take to reach those goals. Again, I just ask if you could just, you know, leave me a line of feedback in, in the reply email, just letting me know if this information was helpful at all. Again, my name is Ashley and I hope you have a great rest of your day.